we are attempting to make some bubble tea at home Let's see how that goes I'm totally in love this is what it looks like set up um, it looks really nice they, they look expensive but this one is like really perfect and they have one two I cannot even begin to tell you how I'm feeling. I'm a big ball of emotions. This is cute. I just don't know where I'm gonna put it. They have another one of it here, Dad, that found it. Hi guys, I don't know for sure if I already did a new vlog intro because I already have like a bunch of clips from, for this vlog. But if I don't, if I didn't already do a new vlog intro, hi guys, welcome to the start of a new vlog. Today's Sunday and it's been a very nice weekend. We went out to the aquarium yesterday. We we had a nice day. We had a bunch of nice things to do yesterday, alhamdulillah. And I just finished filming a skincare tips video upstairs. And I am now in the garage checking on a some DIY that we're doing. We're repurposing this nice big piece of art that we bought from the thrift store. We picked it up like at least a year ago. It's been in this house for a long time. It's like, a, it's like an antique um, piece of art that we saw and we liked. I liked it mostly because of the frame. It's those like old you know gold frame types of artwork and it had like a nice old painting on it but we now want to repurpose that into something more i guess modern this is what the canvas looks like now you can kind of like still see some of the old painting you know still blending through i think he's put a single coat of primer they one coat of primer right can i see the frame i was talking about with like the antique gold frame look we picked this up from goodwill and it was i think 60 dollars because it's really big and yeah i fell in love with the frame i didn't know what we we're gonna do with it but i am very um what's the word optimistic that my diy best friend is gonna make something fantastic out of it i fingers crossed will remember to show you guys what we make out of it so we are attempting to make some bubble tea at home Let's see how that goes i already uh, we already started it and i didn't film most of the preliminary stages but it is currently in the stage where the boba is being made into little rounds let me show you seasonal to choose from so lots of options lots of variety and it's really flexible if you want to change your delivery dates if you want to change your food preferences if you want welcome back to the vlog it's tuesday i have a ton of errands today i'm also going to be making a home goods run i have this painting that i bought from my office a while ago but it didn't work out and it's just been sitting there i'm going to be returning that i don't have the receipt so i'll just be getting store credit and finding something else i like at home goods but yeah, this is what the painting looks like. I don't like it as much as I thought I would, so it's going back. You're fine. Go ahead. <laughs> Thank you very much. I actually think that I'm going to be picking up a laundry basket for one of the kids' rooms. 
um, because we're missing a laundry basket in one of the rooms. This is cute. I just don't know where I'm gonna put it. It's really nice and clean. And it's $100. So maybe I'll pick one of these up. But my problem with the laundry baskets is when you purchase them, they're really sturdy and nice. But after some time, it just becomes a mess and it's wobbly and it's not sitting properly. This looks really nice and sturdy though. Maybe I'll pick up this one. These are so cute. I don't know what they are. Are they like placemats or like for decorating? purposes they're so cute but they don't go with the theme of my house so no <laughs> oh my god this one is perfect oh my god how much are they they look expensive but this one is like really perfect and they have one two three of it which should be more than enough to use as a, like a table runner i don't know but it's cute so beautiful why are these so cute? These are so beautiful. Oh my god. Yep. These are so cute. Back to the vlog. It is, what's today? It's Wednesday and we're taking the kids to grandma's house. Just, and the kids are all packed. They're just praying now and we're going to be heading out. I hope everyone's having a fantastic week. Hi guys. I am on my way out now. I have a few errands and then I'm going to be going to dinner afterwards i'm just going to be stopping by the bookstore to pick up some new books for my kids and then i'm also stopping by home goods i'm trying to look for like a corner plant a fake plant for um a corner of my filming space and i'm hoping that i can find a nice plant that i really really like for that purpose and then after i do those first two stops i'm going to be heading out to grab something to eat I filmed a makeup tutorial video for YouTube earlier, which is why my makeup is so, so top notch and I'm loving it. And I will catch you guys in the next part of the video for the second time. I am now at Ollie's. Ollie's is actually where I buy books for my kids. They have the most amazing, cheapest selection. They have like books from like regular storybooks to school books to like learning books to flashcards and I'm in heaven. I'm in book heaven. I'm about to do a little bit of book shopping for the kids. And I will show you guys my selection. For my daughter, I, I feel like she didn't have as much of an opportunity with flashcards like her brother. He had all the flashcards in the world. And he had a fantastic time, okay? I'm thinking of buying her some flashcards. Um, these multiplication ones are a bit advanced for her. They're age 8 and off, but I'm going to buy them for her brother. Okay, maybe I can do like a sight words card for her. This is a sight words card. It is 99 cents and yeah i think that this is gonna be a good one for her i'll take this one and i'll do numbers i'll do one to hundred numbers for her and this is gonna be it for flashcards they don't have a big selection of flashcards today that's like all, the, all that's in the box so this is all i'm gonna be getting for flashcards and get some writing books I think they have something like this or maybe this I don't think oh, this would be nice oh somebody already wrote in this wow somebody already wrote in this and then they returned it this is a nice book but it's used let me see oh and they used a permanent marker so I would have bought it for my daughter if wow this is a nice book but what is she just in they have another one of the year dad that found it and yeah i think i'm gonna get this one for now i'm going to drop the camera now and do my selection and then when i'm done doing my selection i will share what i what all the books i picked um are with you oh yeah this is my first pick other than the flashcards of course After almost about an hour in all is this is our selection um like i mentioned earlier just a few books for the kids and that did most of the selection this time i just crossed on that and then a stem book and then another stem book um this coding book is really cute <laughs> we're gonna be buying this as well 
and then he has a friend at school whose birthday is coming up next week and we bought a few books for his friend as well and i'm getting old my camera died by the way and it's just sitting in the cart i'm getting old and you know how i know i'm getting old not me buying myself a sudoku book for a bit time as well um i play sudoku on my phone and i feel like that's too late to be exposing myself to um that kind of light so i bought the sudoku book to hopefully play one page of sudoku and go to bed fingers crossed that's how i know i'm getting old and nostalgic i <laughs> i found some archie comic books and i am stoked i'm buying this one a few of them actually i'm also buying this one and i'm buying a couple of them four of them i read a lot of archie comics books growing up and i'm so excited that i found a few books to buy and spend time reading but this is what our cart looks like we're about to head to the front to pay now how cute i found this word search book that says word search your worries away which is accurate because i don't know i play word search when i'm just you know feeling funny so i'm gonna be buying this word search your worries away book 250 mindful puzzles that is so cool and i'm gonna be picking up one of these for 3.99 which is not bad hi guys welcome back to the vlog uh today is 11th of november and today is the day that i launched my website drum rolls for me please <laughs> I cannot even begin to tell you how I'm feeling. I'm a big ball of emotions and I'm just so thankful. I'm excited. I'm thankful because from the inception of the idea that I wanted to give this another shot, but in a different way, from all of the planning to my trips to just executing and branding to just to everything that God has held my hand and has walked this journey with me. And I'm just so thankful to be here. I know that I'm going to learn a lot as I go. But I also know that God is not going to not walk with me. So orders have started rolling in. Um, even though it's a Saturday, I am heading to the post office to fulfill my first orders. We were also on our way to pick up a microwave. Yes, you heard me right, a microwave. Our microwave just start randomly stopped working like a few weeks ago and we haven't had one since then. We haven't had the time to go pick up one. It's been between getting ready for launch day, you know, working and just doing, you know, carrying out all these other obligations that we have but yeah we're going to pick up a microwave we had seen one at sam's club that we really really liked but it was something with the delivery dates being all the way in december and we didn't think that made sense so we found the same microwave at best buy but what we're doing now is we're picking it up from a warehouse that's like close by because we can't wait for it to get delivered so we're going to the best buy warehouse now to pick up our new microwave that's after i dropped my first orders at the ups store if i'm not too tired when i get back home i have a few videos lined up to film i don't want to pack on too much i'm not looking tired in the last video so maybe i'll just see if i can just film that one video or maybe pack on at least two so that i can just edit earlier during the week and get those videos out for you guys so fingers crossed i might be able to film um my brow tutorial today i have a foundation tutorial that went out last week if you haven't seen that hurry up and go watch it okay we just left the best buy warehouse and i came down with the most horrible headache that i have had in a very long time i'm attributing it to all of the stress and just pressure from pre-launch my head is literally like turn right onto the i-80 west ramp pulsating is that the word my head is throbbing yes but the headache is i literally had to take my turban off thank god i had like a drag under it we picked this up from the um best buy warehouse and this is what it looks like in the box it's a pretty big box even though it looks small on the camera we're gonna try and mount it tonight if not we'll mount it tomorrow this is what the old one looks like it just stopped working we don't know why but this is the one that we're replacing and um yeah i'll show you once the new one has been mounted it says to take a i want to take a picture of myself wait i'll take a picture of you i want to sit upstairs to take a shower and the microwave has been unboxed it is so beautiful <laughs> you're taking the picture of me now no even much more beautiful than you know it looked when we first saw it in the store stop it 
when we first were in the store. Um, the old one has also been taken out, so I missed a lot of the action, but um, we're gonna mount this new one now. This is the old one on the floor. I'm just gonna mount this now. It looks so beautiful. I love that it has this little soft touch fill, this big screen look to it, as opposed to like the other one with the handle on it and just the older model type of look. Love this. Brand new stuff. I totally love this. Is what it looks like set up. Um, it looks really nice. I like the fact that it doesn't have a front handle and like the handle is like to the side and like it just goes like that. But yeah, this is my new microwave. I know I shouldn't be this excited about a microwave, but we haven't had one for like a couple weeks and I'm just excited that we have one now. Yay. It's really late in the night. We stayed up to, um, what do you call this to put it up? We stayed up to set it up and we're now going to bed at almost midnight.